On the golf course, Seve Ballesteros was the Tiger Woods of his generation, a mold breaker who set new standards in the game. Born to an accomplished sporting family of modest means in April 1957, Seve began his love affair with golf, playing on the Spanish beaches, save for the occasional illicit moonlight round on his local course in Padrena, and his dedication paid off. In 1974, he turned professional at the tender age of 16, just five years before capturing the game's oldest major when he won the first of his three British Opens in 1979. Having made his mark in Europe, the USA beckoned, and the Spanish phenom headed across the Atlantic, though the American welcome was less than ecstatic, as he told CNN in 2005. It was hard to, to get uh, an invitation, it was hard to get uh, into the majors, especially uh, uh, the US Open. It was not uh, a recall to, that we, we used to have only, only one spot for international players. And at the beginning I was, the, I was the one because I was number one in the world. And obviously they didn't like uh, to see someone coming from a small uh, country uh, like Spain and, uh, and go all over there and, and, um, and take uh, their money as, as uh, I hear uh, several times in the locker room. Here comes the Spaniard to take our money, you know. The money was a bonus, but it wasn't his motivation, as he had his eyes on a slice of history. And in his first year in America, he achieved it, becoming the first European winner of the Masters in Augusta. He'd follow that with a second green jacket three years later, though his success in the States wasn't universally appreciated, as he was first kicked off the 1981 European Ryder Cup team for playing too much in America, and then fell out with the PGA Tour, necessitating a return to full-time action in Europe. The dispute which established Seve's reputation as a maverick eventually led to a rule change, which allowed players more freedom of movement between tours, a benefit they still enjoy today. During 33 years as a professional golfer, Ballesteros won 87 titles, including five majors, took the European Order of Merit title six times, entered the World Golf Hall of Fame in 1999, and a year later cemented his legend when he was named the Spanish Sportsman of the Century and European Player of the Century. Even though he might have been hitting uh, the ball well, he never gave up. Uh, he fought until the end. Um, you know, great matches, we've won matches that uh, look lost, uh, so uh, everything was positive. Personal achievements aside, some of Seve's finest hours came in the Ryder Cup. A dedicated member of the European squad, he was on the winning team four times as a player and then played the role of winning captain in 1997 when he inspired his men with his simple recipe for success. A lot of time of work to develop that talent, uh, discipline, uh, determination, uh, desire, and a good heart. Seve finally retired from playing in July 2007, the victim of chronic back pain. But from then until his death, he remained in touch with the game on which he built his life. I'm going to play uh, just a few holes uh, yeah. behind you. Of course. Behind yeah? us? Yes. Why not in front? Uh, just in case you need a tip. <laughs> <laughs>